Okay, and we're back for another movie on mock exam finals. Um, so this one is question number six. Write the equation in slope inter form, intercept form of the line passing through the point 2, 3 that is perpendicular to this line, y minus 5x equals 4. Okay, so let's remind ourselves what is slope intercept form. That's this. We've got the slope times our variable plus some y-intercept. Okay, um, that's what we're, our end goal is, but that doesn't necessarily need to be what we start with because uh, we've got a point that's not the y-intercept to start with. So I'm going to start with point slope form and I'll move to slope intercept form after that. So here we go. First, let's figure out the slope we need to pick. So this equation gives that to us. So this is y equals 5x plus 4. So that slope is 5. But we want a perpendicular line to this one, which means we need to use the rule that the perpendicular slope is equal to the opposite reciprocal of the given slope. So that's negative one-fifth. Okay. That's something to remember there. So this is the slope we want to have on our line. And our line needs to go through this point, two, three. So let's use point slope form. Point slope form says y minus the y coordinate of the point you go through equals the slope times x minus the x coordinate of the point you want to go through. And that's the equation of the line. <laughs> if you know the slope and a point that it goes through, then you just plug it into this formula. And you've got yourself the equation of the line that has that slope and goes through the point x1, y1. So here we go. This is the equation of the line that is perpendicular to this one and goes through that point. But it's not in the it's not in the form that would be accepted on this test. But we're pretty close. So we'll just add the 3 over and multiply this negative 1 fifth through. So negative x over 5 minus, sorry, plus 2 over 5. That's multiplying it through. And then adding 3. And that's it. Um, but we, it would probably be better to add these two together. So this is negative x over 5 plus 2 fifths plus 15 fifths. That's, uh, that's 3. So this is negative x over 5 plus 17 fifths. And there you have it. That is slope intercept form.